Uh, in the fantastic news department shared with us by, I think Mark was the first one. Matt was was on board. Tony was there, too. There were many, 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 many of you who shared with us this fantastic news that Google has backpedaled on their Google Workspace G Suite my, mandatory migration thing. If you are willing to testify with them that you will use your legacy free G Suite account for personal use only, then they will give you, you the legacy G Suite uh, f account for free forever or at least for free again we don't we can't say forever because you know <laughs> we thought Shoot, it was i'm doing here on the video what uh, a fish shake <laughs> for, for the for, for for everyone that is not watching <laughs> uh for the for the majority of the audience pilot pete do you have a fish shake to share oh boy do i ever because you know they i i got it maybe i should have been more impatient uh, you know patience grasshopper right but yeah the uh the, the fact remains that i, I I saw it coming. I went ahead and put my billing data in there. So it, the legacy would continue on as it went from there. Sure. But it turns out, um, I, I already do have my own server that I lease for my personal website and that sort of thing. So I'm kind of already paying for email yep. anyway in there. Yep. So yep. I migrated out of the Google workspace, G suite, uh, whatever, yeah. else they, whatever other name they've given it over the years and migrated all of that back over to my, my server. So it's Got now it. managing my uh, email. Um, if uh, anybody knows a good divorce attorney, I can put on retainer. <laughs> Please let me know because that stale may be coming. No, uh, Mama was not real happy with uh, with the hiccups that go along with transferring mail servers. No matter oh, what you do or how you do it, the fact is, uh, you know, that as you pointed out at one point, Dave, three, four days later, there's still an occasional email hitting the, the old. Yep. Google IMAP server. Well, and uh, we uh, presume that it was probably a, a, just a cache DNS yeah. that was pointed in that direction. But uh, uh, that was painful. I have swapped it over uh, and I'm going to remain. And now that, that I can go back for free, I'm, I, I think I'm just going to leave it. You're not going to do it. Yeah. Well, yeah, what I would recommend is that you go in and tell like like do the the jump back to free which you can yeah. do it, yeah. it, if if you haven't so oh. so to so catch everybody up them, I want it free okay right you, yeah you, you can now go into your google either your g suite account that you haven't migrated which you need to do something about before the end of this month so you've got about a week uh but but by june 1st they will auto migrate you over unless you go in and and do this attestation that you want to keep the free account and that you're using it for personal. And then it, and then it will just put you on that. But even if you had already migrated to the will be paid in the future account, because they were, they give everybody four months free from when you migrate uh, anyway, just because, uh, well, because they wanted to hedge their bets, I think, and try to figure this out. But once you, uh, if you've done that, you can undo it. You can go in and, and change back to, to that. We'll put a link in the show notes that, that sort of walks through a few of these things. But um, but yeah, it's back to free. 